Oh, why is packing so stressful? <laughs> about to leave. Already packing. I quite like that. Come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. Hi YouTube fam. No. Hi my loves. No. Hey guys, welcome to the channel. No, I'm not feeling it today. Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Today is a compact with me video featuring hairy legs, greasy hair, stressed out body, because I love packing. That's a complete fabrication of the truth, I hate packing. Um, having to get my whole life in order for 10 days in one suitcase stresses me out beyond belief. But if you like to see people stress out, pull their hair out, get PTSD, overpacking, then stick around. Secondly, if you're new to the channel, hi, my name's Chrissy. I'm a mum of two. I don't know why I keep doing this. I have no idea. Hi, my name's Chrissy. I'm a mum of two. I'm literally sweating because... Today, of all days, the UK decides to have a heat wave the day I'm trying to pack. Can't open my windows because all you'll hear is mm, because they're digging at the road literally outside of my door. And thirdly, I'm flustered already and it's not even 10 minutes in. But I'm gonna go through what I'm packing for myself and my kids. Um <laughs> I'm I'm so easily distracted today. I'm not going to come in with the Pepsi Max or the cup of tea. I'm going to go in with the big guns today. If you know, you know. Um, sugar free isn't actually any better for you, believe it or not, and it doesn't give me the same buzz. So I'm going for a full fat Red Bell. Red Bull. Yeah, I've got loads of little tips and tricks along the way. So stick around. And yeah, I'll show you how I pack my case. Let's do it. Also, PPS, going to Turkey. 10 days. I think the weather is about high 20s, early 30s, which is perfect. Any hotter than me, I cannot actually cope. I'm that person that wears Factor 50 because I hate getting burnt. But yeah, we move. But yeah, I'm going to show you what I'm packing on my holiday, all my cute little bits. And yeah, little tips and tricks. Sauce for the hair. It's just like, I'm not feeling it. I need to be able to like, do you know what I mean? Like I'm getting stressed. I need to be able to go like this. I've not really got much makeup on today either. I just need to be able to like stress. Is that weird? Like I can't be like full blown done up because then, I don't know, I just feel a bit, I don't even think I'm making sense. But you know what I mean? Like I need to be able to go, oh, I need to bring Adam and be able to touch my face without like getting layers of makeup on my hands. And yeah, if I could get away with wearing no bra right now, I'd be doing that literally in the nude and literally nothing on because it's so hot. But I don't think you guys would want to see that. So let's get into it. PPS, me and Adam took a trip to Primark last night because I had some really, cute suit, um, some really cute suitcases, but there was literally none in. We ended up having to go to John Lewis and pay a million pounds for this ugly case. I'm really, really upset about it. I don't know if you can tell. But it is really lightweight and it's practical, as Adam would say. But I don't do practical, I wanted pretty. So yeah, I've got this big old case and what I like to do first is pop my shoes in. This was me literally a second ago. Where are my Crocs? I'm gonna lose my Where are my Crocs? Huge Croc fan over here. <laughs> Most of you, 50% are guaranteeing the YouTube analytics will click off the video once they see these but i don't care because i'm converted I absolutely love my life so going in with the shoes first obviously it's got to be these for comfort for pool days for evenings out for every single occasion because you start crocs telling yourself they're just gonna leave the garden but they end up multi-purpose uses evening h&m because they're a little bit of a platform but not heels as such they're comfortable not the most comfortable, but they're pretty. Adam calls them my anchor sandals. <laughs> but I really like them. Let me know what you think. And obviously, can you even go on holiday without the 90p basic Primani sandals? No. 
also picked these up from Primark as well. Just for pure comfort, really, round by the pool. I love a slip on. <laughs> 29, and I'm bragging about loving a slip on shoe. But yeah, really bright white. Will look lovely with a tan. And then, last but not least, these are the comfiest sandals that I own. So yeah, it's got to be those. Tortoiseshell, nice, kind of look a little bit dressy. Probably could do with a little clean, to be honest. God knows what that is. But yeah, they're going to go in the bottom of my case. Fun fact, if you turn them on their side, you can actually get more in. <coughs> So for the kids, for the girls, which are age four and seven, if you're new, I picked up these. This, because Lily's really good at rolling this on herself. It's a roll on one. Let's see if I can take the lid off. You've probably seen it before. They do it in Aldi as well, but we're actually using that one at preschool today. So yeah, I've got her that one. And then they've got a 50, very high spray one. And then I do also like a lotion, especially to smother on their shoulders, etc., etc. And then for me and Adam, I just went for the sprays because I just think they're a lot easier. I do use a 50 on my face and my shoulders as well because I'm prone to getting sunstroke. But yeah, Adam, I got him this, well, I got me a 30 SPF and Adam a 15. And then he wanted some bronze and tanning oil. So I picked him some of that. And this looked really good. Seen this in Home Bargains. It's a Miracle Tan Moisturising Before and After Sun Lotion so you literally pop it on before and after and you're meant to get a really good tan so yeah i've got that and then for after sun adam wanted a spray on one not used this one before this is the og of after sun isn't it pop this in your fridge it literally smells incredible and then last but not least i picked this up from primark for three pounds and it's a hair and scalp sun spray because i always get a burnt head and it peels so i'm hoping this will prevent that And then with three of us going and traveling, three girls, I picked up these really cute little travel cases. Coming as a two pack from Wilkinson's, believe it or not. Um, and it wasn't expensive at all. I was gonna do Amazon, but I do find sometimes it's a little bit more pricey, I think, because it's so convenient. So yeah, I literally just popped all of our hair bubbles and things all into this. Seems like quite extreme, but you can never have enough hair bubbles in my opinion. And then I'm just gonna put the rest of our hair care, skin care and things like that in here. So then literally it's just all together in one place and I can just literally carry it out. When it comes to skincare, shock horror, I think you all know my skincare regime by now. I'm pretty basic and I stick to the same things. So I've got my so I've got my Lecura cleansing balm because I absolutely love taking my makeup off with this. It's really really nice. And my day cream, which is also Lecura, really, really love this. Has it got SPF on it? What? Oh yeah, and it's got SPF 15 in there. So yeah, I'll be taking that. And then obviously, I've got my Overnight Repair Concentrate Oil, which I really, really like, especially if your skin's quite dry. And then this one, which is the Super Booster. Really, really love this. Especially on holiday, because you're not really wearing makeup in the day. So this just gives you a glowy complexion. Healthy Glow Toner. Love, love, love. The Hot Cloth Cleanser, because this is an essential. And then I've got a little repair mask, if I want to have a little pamper, because I really like this from time to time. And just a little travel-sized hairspray, really, for me and the girls. While I'm on the subject of holiday essentials, this part of the video is kindly in collaboration with Cherries. Cherries is ultimately an online bargain shop. So really, really cheap, really, really affordable. Really, if you've not used Cherries before, there's a really easy app you can use. They've also got a website and essentially there's so many products on there from cleaning to toiletries, to hair and beauty, to really lovely home bits, snacks, the snacks 
I've been struggling to find the little mini Pringle tubs everywhere and they've got them on cherries by the way thank me later because I wanted to pop them in my travel hand luggage for the girls to eat on the plane because they charge you millions of pounds on the airplane for things like that so yeah went onto the cherries app didn't i to get all of my basics and i just wanted to show you what i got so before i show you what i got i just wanted to let you know that they've kindly given me a discount code and i'll pop it on screen and in the description box if you want to go and take a look um, I'll put all the information below for you. But yeah, first things first, Twiglets, because they're Adam's favourite. I'm struggling to find these, actually, in most places. And then we've got this huge Lynx Africa. This is like the OG, isn't it, that everyone gets at Christmas, if you're a man. If you're a man watching, comment down below. Do you always get these sets at Christmas? So yeah, I got that for Adam for his holiday. And I also got him a Dove, because I'm not sure which one he would want. And then going on for toiletries for me, I got myself a Dove because really, really cheap, really, really affordable, much cheaper than most supermarkets. And I also got myself a roll-on deodorant because I really needed one of these. And then I wanted a really nice conditioning treatment for my holidays. I picked up some Aussie. This smells kind of like bubblegum ice cream. It's beautiful. <sighs> Love it. So yeah, I got that. And then one of these, because it's just really good for the girls to exfoliate their skin and myself on holiday. Because you know what it's like? Your skin just takes a bash in, doesn't it? So yeah, pick that up. That's what I mean. You can literally get anything from Cherries. That's why I love it so much. Needed some window and glass cleaner. So I picked that up, along with the Astonish OxyActive Plus stain remover. Because I've got the one for your whites, but I've not got it for my normal ones. And this will come in really handy. Especially over the summer period with stains, kids and ice lollies, etc. Really, really love this. And then I needed some more cotton pads, like 100% and essential. So yeah, I've got them and I love it because they come in a smaller packet. So I can just pop them straight in my case. And then I thought I'd treat myself to, I'm your Venus, I'm your fire, your desire. Um, <laughs> yeah, a shaver. So yeah, I've got that. Love it. Comes with one stick and two shavers so that'll be really useful and this is the sensitive one smooth because we're all a little bit sensitive in those areas so yeah and then this is really random as well i've been on the hunt i think i went into b&m the other day to look for one but i couldn't get one and um, this is a lightning usb cable for iphone i needed one for my car so i can plug my phone in and listen to music and things like that because my one stopped working so yeah love that and then like i said with the pringles they were on offer so we're going to take these in our hand luggage because if you didn't or did if you did or didn't know i'm telling you now you can take your own snacks on the plane it saves you so much money because these are like two pound fifty a pop on the plane and these were on offer i think it was two for one pound something i'll pop a note on and let you know what i got them for so yeah really excited and they've stopped doing the little mini pack i've not seen them anywhere else so thanks sherry's for that and last but not least, had to get myself a little snack, didn't I? So I went for the Haribo bubblegum bottles. I would love to say that these are for the plane, but I'm 100% going to probably eat these tonight because they look so yummy. And then uh, my sink just gets really clogged up. So I wanted to get some drain sticks. Keep your drain pipes clear and odour free. So I picked these up and I'm hoping that they can get all the grit out so it drains a little bit quicker. I'll let you know what these are like. And on one of my next cleaning videos... I'll use these and show you how I get on. And then, this is what I mean. You can literally, this is what I mean. You can literally pick up anything. I'm so excited. So I picked up these sunglasses because I've only got one pair. So should we try them on? You can let me know what I look like. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I can't see you properly because the lighting in here is awful. But I quite like them. Let me go and have a look in the mirror. These were, I think, £2.50, which really isn't bad, is it? And they're really nice, and they're a little bit thicker than the ones that I've got from Primark. So, yeah, buzzing about these. Loving the packaging. I just needed some shaving cream, ran out. And I got Adam some Shaw deodorant. So, yeah, that was everything. So, yeah, there's my little haul. I'm going to use probably half of this to pop and take on holiday with me. But like I said, 
thank you so much for cherries for working with me on this i really love cherries this isn't the first time that i've worked with you so i really appreciate the collaboration and yeah i'll pop all of this in my suitcase but like i said i'll pop everything in the description box down below for you to go and have a look if you want to picked up two of these really cute organizers i'll show you what they look like inside so they come like this it's actually a makeup bag i just think it'll be really good if i ever pop all of my toiletries in or my makeup i haven't quite decided yet but i bought two of them um, and it might be good to put yeah sorry might be really good to use to pop all of my toiletries in shampoos conditioners and things like that because then it's all in one ready to go so my toiletries are a little bit standard a pack of five toothbrushes but obviously we'll only need two these for the girls my friend picked these up for me bless her some deodorant i like to have the roll-on and the anti -price antiperspirant because i'm a sweaty bitch i'm joking because 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 toothpaste is the only one my kids will have so we'll probably just all share this one some cute hair oil because my hair does get really dry because it's got bleach on it this because it's literally everything i'm not going to go into depth about it Will the camera focus but it's literally goals and then i was going to dilute this down but all three girls will all probably be using it so i just don't see the point but I did pick this up from Wilkinson's as well. It's literally like 60p. And I'm going to pop a little bit of the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle Moisture in here. I've also got like a travel shampoo and a travel conditioner as well. Okay, I also picked these up from Wilkinson's and they're amazing. They're just little wash bags. They were literally a pound. And I've gone a little bit overboard on medicines and things. But whenever we go away, someone's always ill. Um, Adam either suffers really bad of hay fever. I've had constipation before. Um, the girls have had a cold before. So it's just better to be prepared, in my opinion. Also have a little bit of anxiety as well. I also have a little bit of anxiety as well. So this might seem a little bit much for you guys. But for me, it's better to be safe than sorry. So for all of our medicines, I've just gone with the usual. Paracetamol, ibuprofen, Rennie. I've got the Anagen Extra and the Cold and Flu. They basically do the same thing, but I'm allergic to this one. So I picked that up for me. And then obviously a hay fever relief and... A nasal spray because this is a must so yeah i'm just going to pop all of our bits oh and these <laughs> because i snore so bad at the moment i don't know what's going on so adam insists i take these <laughs> so yeah i'm going to pop all of ours in one and then i've got some for the girls to pop in in their own little one i'll label them both so my friend picked these up the mosquito bands they're really good actually they're a good preventer i've got a spray somewhere but i need to dig it dig it out just a few plasters some pads, vapor rub, Nurofen and Cowpole, because if they do get a cold, they're going to need both if, it, if they're suffering. So yeah, that's what I've got for them. So I'm just going to pop them both in here and they're reusable as well. That's what I like about them. I haven't bought any plastic Ziploc bags this time. I've gone for reusable because I can use them again and again. So yeah, got to mention as well, these were literally one pound.
So you see me on Wednesday. You didn't see me, but I absolutely lost my mind. I got really tired. So today is Saturday. We go away next week and I've got to get the rest of the packing done. I've got to get my clothes packed, the girls' clothes packed. And just basically go for it. So yeah, I'm going to do it. It's going to happen. I'm probably going to get a little bit stressed in the process. Definitely haven't had a few arguments with Adam this morning. Um, but yeah, we move. Played a game with Uno. Really struggling to keep on top of the housework. Played a game with Uno. Really struggling to keep on top of the housework. But yeah. Take you upstairs. I've moved all the cases in here. And yeah, I just need to put all the clothes, things like that, in the cases. I think, yeah, that's my case. And that's the girl's case. So we're not far off, to be honest. Been trying to pack the girls' suitcases for ages and I'm just nowhere with it. This is a ridiculous amount of clothes for 10 days. They don't need it, but I've probably gone a little bit overboard and I want them to have all their new bits as well. So now I'm like, do I go through it and take some bits out or do I just pack it all, even though they're probably not going to need it? Oh, why is packing so stressful? <laughs> I literally today feel like I just want to go back to bed. I'm absolutely exhausted. Excuse all the rubbish behind me. This is literally, I don't even know if you can see. This is literally the spare room. It's just the dumping ground at the moment. We haven't really done anything with it since we moved in. But <clears throat> I'll talk you through really quickly what I'm packing for the girls for a 10 day hot holiday. They've both got their denim jackets, which they'll probably travel over in, so that's fine. And then they're both gonna wear these pumps to travel with. Lily's already wore hers, hence why they're a bit muddy. And then I've, they've both got some sliders and then some sandals. Always stick with Clark's or sandals because they're comfortable, they don't rub on their feet and they're just a good all-rounder. And also go for a neutral coloured shoe because then they go with every single outfit. And then they've got like their Crocs to wear by the pool, etc. etc. So then I thought I'd go for we're going for 10 days, so I thought 10 evening outfits and then 5 day outfits. No, I was going to go for 5 evening outfits and 5 day outfits because they'd probably wear them again. But I've ended up with 10 evening outfits and 10 day outfits, which is ridiculous. But I think I'm just going to pack it. <laughs> oh, I don't know. We'll see. If you want to see more of a holiday haul, check out one of my latest videos, which is <clears throat> a huge kids clothing haul because predominantly most of that has been packed. I also highly, highly, highly recommend these. These are swimming goggles from Amazon. You get two pairs, £15. They're fab because they have the clasp at the back. They just clip onto their head rather than trying to adjust the straps all the time because it's, it's annoying. And then I always go with two hats and then they take one of these on the plane with them. And then again, the zip-up hooded towels that I've got. These are fab. They're from Primark. And then I always take like one cardigan each because it can sometimes get a little bit chilly at night and always try and take one pair of trousers as well. Because you never know, sometimes you do have a little bit of a cold today, don't you? So yeah, let's get it packed in the case. Yay! High five! Woohoo! 
And that's it, we're all packed. Um, if you wanna see what we pack for on the plane, then stick around, because we're doing an airport, come to the airport with me vlog. And I'll show you what I include for the girls to keep them entertained on the plane. And yeah, I was gonna roll all the girls' clothes, like I did mine in the case, but I've just kept them in their piles, because then when I unpack, I can literally unpack them. I also put in a few spare hangers so we can carry things, so we can hang more things up. You don't get enough hangers, do you, Lily? And show them what your preschool gave you to take on holiday. A teddy bear! Yeah, cute little teddy bear, isn't it? That's the camera, that's the viewfinder to look in here. Cute little teddy bear, show them. So we're going to take him, we just told you it's there. So we're going to take him on holiday with us, aren't we? Yeah. And document all his travels. So yeah, that's it. That's my compact with me. Stress is over, we can drop our suitcases off at our friend's house and let the fun begin, <laughs> hey? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Show them they your really beautiful holiday nose. Holiday nose? Holiday nails. So look, go like that. Oh, can you see unicorns? Beautiful, aren't they? Yeah, I look at my toes. And your toes, mummy did them, didn't she? Yeah. Beautiful. So yeah, we're ready to go. Yeah. So only two days to holiday. <laughs> Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give this video a big thumbs up. Yeah. High five.